Lions ASMR Sports here. Hope everybody's having a nice Sunday evening. Um, I am watching Red Sox Yankees over here. Um, Yankees are uh, very frustrating to watch <laughs> because they seem to uh, leave 150 guys in scoring position every single inning. Um, anyways, yeah, I have not done a video in a while and I've been wanting to do content, but I just can't really figure out what I want to do. Um, I have a lot of cards to go through, graded cards to, like, price, and, um, um, think about selling, and uh, I actually was thinking about doing a video, actually, if you listen very close, you can hear this game is on upstairs, um, but I have a, um, do some orbit today. I, uh, second to last piece right there. I have lots of cards to go through and kind of price out and then, um, list. And, uh, I was thinking about, like, doing a video showing me listing a card. Um,. I don't know 
who they were thinking they who they who they thought the market was that was uh, served by that decision, but. I'd rather see like a bonus pack of five rookies of 2018. So maybe we'll, we'll open the bonus pack first because I think that's going to be the least interesting. Yankees are down 4-3 in this game. I'm watching third, third game here of the opening uh, series for both the Yankees and the Red Sox being played in New York. The Yankees are down 4-3 in the seventh inning there. They've got a man on first and two outs. 3-2 count to Hicks, so... Okay, okay, well... Oh, Hicks hits a little crap grounder. He's out. Alright, so it's not all Babe Ruth cards, so that's good. That's uh, actually a huge improvement over a five-card pack of uh, Babe Ruth cards. Alright, so we got Eric Hosmer. These are like these um, kind of like weird sort of framed cards where it's like inset and there's like a border kind of glued on top of there. Oh, we got Cal Ripken. We got Eddie Stanky. And another Eddie Stanky. Arts proof, blue arts proof. And that is not numbered. And then I guess there's one Babe Ruth card in. And that's just probably a base. So actually that pack, that bonus pack is pretty sweet because it's got, you know, these, I don't know what to call these cards, but sort of some kind of parallel. And then, um, you know, modern players, old players, everyone in between. So pretty cool actually, that definitely improves the, I think, the quality of these blasters. So let's get into the main packs, shall we? speak 
the devil. There's a star right there, Juan Soto, nice second year card, very nice. Carl Hubble. Hall of Fame heroes, Yogi Berra. Justin Verlander, back from uh, an injury this year. Chris Davis. All right, we got two packs left now. So we've got one Acuna and one Soto, so that's nice. That's particularly interesting beyond that. to sweep a three-game 
series against the rival Red Sox to start the season. That would be pretty amazing and probably not what a lot of people expected. I think Yankee fans have been pretty down on uh, our chances based on where the team was at the beginning of the, you know, or the end of the off season. Well, you never can tell in baseball what's going to happen. Um, so someone emailed me um, asking about, you know, what kind of products I would want to have people buy for opening up. And I, I haven't really had a chance to go through much to um, sort of think about what I, w what I think would be fun to open. But um, a couple of things did sort of come to mind. Um, this uh, 2020 Bowman box comes from a case where uh, I had, uh, I, I would have preferred not to have opened the case, but I got an order from uh, Hot Cardboard that um, I didn't realize I had sort of oversubscribed the uh, number of boxes available to purchase on the site. Um, so I didn't have a loose box available. I had to crack a case of 12 of these. And so I, I think I've sold um, two boxes out of that case. Um, and I have, you know, 10 left. Um, this, this is a product where, unfortunately, um, the per box price of an entire case of a sealed case is much higher than the um, value of a with a kind of a market price, the dealer market price of a loose box. So I would have been well served to have kept that case um, sealed, but I sold the box and I, if I have a product, even if it's in a case, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sell it. So I opened up that case. I constantly have a bunch of these and this is a very hot product right now. It's got um, first, first Bowman Auto and Parallels of um, uh, Anthony Volpe of the Yankees shortstop, very uh, well-regarded um, prospect who a lot of people are think are going to be, you know, it's going to be the next big name in the Yankees. Um, talent uh, depth roster. Um, of course, you have uh, Bobby Witt uh, Jr. cards, and he's, you know, kind of all the rage. He was the number one prospect in the minors before um, making his debut here in the 2022 season. And then, um, you know, these sort of uh, original <laughs> hype guy in 2020, 2020 Bowman was uh, Jason Dominguez, the uh, Yankees international um, signing who uh, was like 17 or something when he signed. And, um, you know, they call him the Martian because uh, he's got some extraordinary talent for his age. Um, and, uh, you know, basically, he, he, he was, I can't remember what year he was signed, but it was probably like 2019 or something. And, um, you know, we'd, nobody really knew when he'd show up in Bowman, and it was kind of a surprise, like, just before this stuff. Um, get the market, you know, they announced or it was sort of discovered that he was on the checklist. And then the d price of this stuff doubled overnight. Then kind of when it came out, uh, you know, prices were very high, but after a few months it kind of cooled down. Values of the stuff went went down a fair bit. And then, um, you know, kind of as Bobby Witt uh, Jr. started to heat up, um, these have gotten more and more expensive. So I think if you went to uh, blow out these are probably like 800 bucks or something. Um, anyways, so I have, I have a few of these lying around that I could, you know, um, part with. And um, this would be something that I think would be fun to open, like either in a quarter box. Um, you know, so everybody buys a fourth of the box. Um, or like even per pack. I'm not sure what uh, that would be per pack, but... Um, probably not like super cheap if these are, you know, six fifty, seven fifty per box. But anyways, that would be one thing. I don't expect anybody to buy a whole box of that for me to open on the channel, but <laughs> if we can figure out a way to kind of, um, do kind of like a box break of it where everybody buys a pack or a quarter pack or, a, I don't know, a twelfth, which would be two packs, um, that would be fun. 
So, um, yeah, anyways, uh, another product that just sort of caught my eye that I have quite a few of these. I think I have like eight or nine of these 2019 Topps Chrome um, trading boxes. These are boxes that, um, you know, when the season was going last year and Vlad was doing really well in Tetis, you know, was in one of his uh, non-injured streaks. Um, this product was up to like a thousand bucks or even a little bit more than that per box. It's, it's down quite a bit. I think these are maybe like $700 boxes now. Um, but, you know, it is. Um, Vlad and Tatis and other 2019 rookie class guys like, um, Eloy Jimenez and, there's my stomach saying hello, um, Eloy Jimenez and, um, Pete Alonso. And, uh, you know, the usual suspects. So, could be could be a fun one to open. Um, this has the same number of packs as that Bowman. It's 24, but each pack only has four cards. So, I don't know if I could sort of figure out a, a way to maybe do like a break of this or a break of the Bowman. Um, the thing about the breaks is that, you know, they kind of have to be live because they don't have to be what they traditionally are live. Which... Um, you know, isn't the best for having regular content on the site. Um, I mean, you know, doing live streams is great um, sometimes, but in terms of having content for the site, um, I don't know if I would want to do a break that way, but I guess if everybody didn't care, I, I wouldn't mind doing it that way. I just know lots of people like to kind of follow along live, you know, when they buy in to a break. So, um, I don't know, I'll be thinking about ways to sort of format these things, and I'm I'm going to go look, you know, around and see what else I've got, because um, there's lots of stuff that I I would like to open, but I don't really want to, you know, sort of, like, just do it for my own gratification. I'd rather, like, have somebody um, buy a box and then open it on a video and share that all with you um, on the channel, and so to the extent there are boxes like that that I want to uh, propose, you know, folks uh, take a look at for possible purchase, I will do that. And maybe do another video kind of like this one where I'm showing you stuff that, you know, I think would be fun to open on a video. And then if anybody's interested, they can buy it and tell me to open it and I'll do that. Or they can just buy it and I'll ship it to them if they would rather not. But yeah, I got lots of stuff <laughs> sitting around that I'd like to get rid of. But that's what we got for today, everybody. So I hope you're all doing well. I hope the Yankees uh, get something going here <laughs> and uh, maybe take a run at this game. All right, we'll catch y'all later. Have a great one. Bye now.